for saving my life. Thank you very much for coming back uh, and watching another one of my videos. Well, I'm here today because we are going to do another bonus video. So again, I did one earlier on. Uh, it's the same video, but I'm going to do a different context on it. Now, the reason I'm really doing it is because I've had several messages since. Uh, I didn't realise, and I thought it'd be really interesting for you guys to know uh, and see the video again, because you might not watch the original video, but now you can watch the video in complicit in this one. Now, I didn't realise last night, uh, but I played a, a really good squad, as we call them, God Squads, uh, it, and I said last night uh, it was one of the most enjoyable games I had on FIFA for a very long time. Uh, again, I've put the full footage on here, unedited, and you get to watch it and uh, watch the game unfold uh, one way or another and, and see how a really good game of uh, FIFA, to be fair. Now, it is a God Squad. Now, I don't have a God Squad. I have a 188 team, uh, which is good and very good. Uh, I love it. And uh, yeah, so it, it's good. But this is a 193 God Squad. Now, the reason I'm redoing this is, like I said, I've had several messages saying, do you realise who you played last night? Uh, which I didn't. Now, I played no other than the second best footballer in the world, apparently, Virgil van Dijk. Uh, so this is Virgil van Dijk's team. Uh, and I had no idea that I was uh, playing Virgil van Dijk last night. So with that in mind, let's go through his squad again. Uh, I have checked it out and it does seem legit uh, that I have uh, played Virgil van Dijk's team last night. So let's go through his squad and have a look at what... Uh, what it looks like so we've got r9 up front so you've got 94 rated r9 you then have pele next to him uh wow what a combination that is uh we have uh his club mate uh mané 97 team of the year out there with uh fellow countrymen now so this is quite obvious now to me that it was virgil van dyke uh fellow countryman uh hullet uh, there in midfield with uh, Dijon, also fellow countryman, uh, team of the year. Uh, we've got uh, Ronaldinho. Why wouldn't you have Ronaldinho in your team? Uh, we've got teammate uh, Robertson on the left, uh, an 86 rated in form. Uh, we've got... Um, Strangely, uh, Thiago Silva, maybe his friend, I don't know, uh, but he's uh, Thiago Silva's up spotted in there uh, with team of the year clubman uh, Allison there in goal. And then, uh, yeah, on the right hand side, we have also uh, teammate Trent Alexander Arnold, team of the year 95. And there you go, there's the proof. Uh, I didn't know what the card was originally, and I did ask for help. And people have come to me and uh, messaged me and DM me and told me uh, that you can only get that 99 rated card if you are. Virgil van Dyke, the pro. Uh, so again, obviously it's a pro card. Uh, when they do uh, the team of the weeks and stuff like that, they also have a a, a celebrity like team, uh, which again used to be a big deal uh, and used to have to play them to get into uh, squad battles. Now they're just at the top next to team of the week, and very rarely do I ever look at them. Uh, but there would have been a Virgil van Dyke team. And this is his Virgil van Dijk team. Uh, Vuri FC, that makes sense. And again, now has a Dutch sign on it. So even more makes sense. As you can see, he's got a rating of 193 uh, with 99 chemistry, which is a bit weird why he's got a uh, Thiago Silva plonked in there. I would have said uh, there's probably other, yeah, again, I would put a Dijon in there or someone like that, which would give a, a stronger link. Uh, but yeah, I don't know. Uh, amazing, amazing. So yes, last night I played second in the world Ballon d'Or uh, Virgil van Dijk uh, today he had a game against Norwich uh, so I'm guessing he was chillaxing on the old uh, PlayStation 4 and uh, playing FIFA and playing me uh, so there you go guys uh, that is the story that is how I've played Virgil van Dijk now comes the footage uh, you can watch the game in its entirety uh, FIFA saved their, my life versus at Virgil van Dijk. Please leave a like, please leave a subscribe. Uh, it means a lot to me. 50% of my profits go to charity to mind the charity at, and uh, yeah, enjoy the video. Take care of yourself, guys. Uh, if you can't take care of yourself, uh, uh, find someone who can. Peace. Benito Villamarín, where the action will soon get underway.
I'm Derek Ray here on the commentary position, joined by Lee Dixon to help me describe all the action. And what we have coming up for you is a rivals game to look forward to. I can't wait for this, Lee. Yeah, thanks, Derek. I'm just hoping we get a nice, quick tempo from the start of this game. Both teams do like to get forward, both positive in their approach in the game. So we should be in for some entertainment. The initial 11 today for the hosts. It looks like a conventional 4-4-2. I preferred formation by Arsene Wenger when he arrived at Arsenal. Two main strikers, four across the midfield. Really important for the fullbacks to link up with the wide midfielders in this system. Attending to his defensive chores. Well, he has to be regarded always as a dangerous opponent, but what should we expect to see from him in this game, Lee? He's on the ball all the time, and his ability on the ball is absolutely phenomenal. He doesn't pass the ball away, he lends it to his teammates because he wants it back. It's very difficult to get the ball off him. Well, they were clearly on the receiving end, so a free kick is next. Werner, Del Piero, wonderful chance! Can they slot it home? Well, that's fine goalkeeping, real concentration. Well, he's given a corner, their referee. Well, that was the chance to take the lead, and the manager's frustration is there for all to see. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Lampard, can they take the lead? Keeper's contribution, but what next? Well, the fans know they were lucky not to be behind there. They can't keep conceding chances like that. Far from a good pass. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. It's Mane getting forward effectively. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. An opportunity in the air, but he's made a bit of a mess of that one. Oh, it's really a shocking effort. I could do better than that, and I can't head the ball. Must score! And in it goes from Ronaldo! The opening goal of the game, then. Alessandro Del Piero. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Into the advanced position. Ball's gone. It is to be a throw in. And the cross is very much on. Well, he found himself in an illegal position, hence offside. Well, a silly mistake there, really silly. Robertson. Gullit. Sadio Mane now. Pele. Straight down the throat of the opposition. Mane. Pele, and return to Mane. Is it going to be Robertson? Well, it's all going so swimmingly for them here. Another goal, and now it's a matter of avoiding any silly mistakes. Well, a second goal for them here. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Del Piero. Werner. Chance to reduce the arrears. And it's gone in. As we can see, right place at the right time. Striker's instinct is to be there or thereabouts. Keeper has no chance. So there we have it. 2-1. Kenny Lala. Lampard. De Bruyne now. 
Just not looking confident in possession. Room to manoeuvre on the wing. And he's alone in the middle by the look of things. Oh, it's off the post! Oh, it's in! A two-goal cushion now, and the lead fully merited. Obviously, it's a tap-in, Derek, but it's the patience in the box I like. A predator's instinct, just waiting for the ball to come to him. No shortage of goals on this match. 3-1. It's with Del Piero. Crossing opportunity. Top-notch tackle. Not much time to make up his mind. They've regained possession. Del Piero. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Lampard. Del Piero. The hosts are struggling in terms of possession, but they won't mind. They're winning this game. And why? Because their counter-attack is absolutely fantastic. Into the advanced position. And they could get one back here. And oh, it's in! We cannot declare this contest over. They still believe. Well, here it is again, Derek, and when the ball goes in wide areas, sometimes defenders struggle to stop the crosses. They did on that occasion, and in the end, it's poor defending, but the ball's ended up in the back of the net. 3-2 it is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? Ronaldo. And that is how to thwart them. Kevin De Bruyne couldn't keep the ball. Ronaldo. Superb challenge from Nesta. And Pelle on the ball. Well, great read there to intercept. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Might be able to set up the chance. Super goalkeeping, it was one against one. Oh, I really fancy the attacker there to go round him, but it's brilliant goalkeeping in the end. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Socrates. Well, that is how to play advantage. Socrates. Del Piero. They've given it away. Werner. It is a decent looking attack here. No nonsense clearance. Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. Fisted clear. High pressing at its best. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Werner. And foiled by Van Dijk. A complete miscue by the goalkeeper. Will there be a price to pay? You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. And it's with Ronaldinho. Ronaldo on the ball. Pulit. Oh, that's an interesting pass. And a goal it is. They lead by two now. Fully deserved. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Won it back. And that was a very fine read. A 
A move of promise on the flank. Crossed into the penalty area. And he's clear his lines. De Jong. Pele. Given away. Sadio Mane now. Ronaldo. Playing with purpose and control. Ronaldo. And the keeper there to make sure nothing untoward happened. Lampard with it. Lala. And now Kevin De Bruyne. Alessandro Del Piero. Moving the ball forward with purpose. It was a fine-looking attack, but now they've given the ball away. Ronaldo couldn't keep it. Thiago Silva. Ronaldinho. Lost possession. De Bruyne. Alessandro Del Piero. Werner. Well, visionary passing. Alex Del Piero. And in it goes. Well, the keeper will be frustrated. He thought he'd saved it. He's so unlucky there. It's a good angle from him as well, but it's in the back of the net. Well, what an extraordinary scoreline. Does this game have more goals in it? Robertson. Ronaldo on the ball. Can he make it count? Counter-attacking very much an option. Werner. Oh, maybe the equaliser. Magnificent stuff, and quite the comeback from two goals down. Well, look at this. Don't you just love counter-attack football? Absolutely brilliant. One key ingredient, pace, and they've got it in abundance. What they do to that defence from then on is absolutely brilliant. If you enjoy high-scoring contests, this has been the game for you. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Now you've got to try to make it a bit more difficult for your opponent than that. Excellent challenge. 15 minutes remaining. Well, it's been a frustrating day for these fans. They want a goal. They're urging their team on to attack. Vision in abundance from Hulit. That's all they can conjure for now. Lala. And that was a move of great promise. They could easily have been in. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Lampard. Lala. Now they're on the scent of something positive. The cross is on. Lampard. He's got to score! And the keeper would have been disappointed had he not dealt with it. Well, the two sides still locked together. And a set piece, a corner, can make all the difference. Corner kick played in. Not all that convincing defensively. Henri. Pelé. Tremendous ball played through. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. And it's a case of just five minutes left.
possession changes hands the interception there Werner and the advantage accrues to the attacking side I think everyone knew that was foul play and the referee left with little choice but to award the free kick He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look at the referee, how he's told him up. Will he finish? Well, they have the goalkeeper to thank for the fact that this game is still level. Well, they can never drop their concentration, goalkeepers. They can never have a rest. It's a brilliant stop at this stage in the game. Now they've lost it. The electronic board has been held aloft. Two additional minutes here. front foot looking for a winner near the end of this game Kenny Lala a chance maybe from the wide position and scope for the cross he cuts it back and that was a very fine read and the referee blows for full time Well, he is a player with the capacity to enthrall Timo Werner. Lee, let's get your assessment as regards his performance in this game. Well, he's played so well today and got the goals as well, but those goals have only got his team a draw. He'll be looking over his shoulder at his defenders and saying, I'll get the goals and you just keep them out.